hi uh, this video is about use of layer wake variables i have here with me data of stores and their service quality what the customers have evaluated so i'll do a chi square analysis go to cross tabs put in rows the store that's the type of uh, type of the store and their corresponding satisfaction in exact i will not do anything in statistics the chi square contingent coefficient phi and lambda eta i will uncheck If you look at the data of store 2, the strongly positive value is lower compared to the other. If I look at the chi-square values, the Pearson chi-square value is 16, however it is not significant, suggesting that there is no significant association between the store and the uh, service satisfaction however here one factor we have uh, uh, not uh, considered that is the contact with service employee now the customers can evaluate uh, the service quality based on their contact with the service employees so I have here another layer variable have contact with the employee and I click it. Now if I look here the chi-square value when there is no contact with the uh, service employee the chi-square value is not significant at 0 0.05 level and when there is a contact with uh, the contact employee it there is a significant difference between the store and the, the satisfaction. So here with the contact of the service employee plays a layer variable. Now let's look at the directional measures. <coughs> this value is less than 0.1 suggesting the directional me measures are fine and the, if you look at the symmetric measures this value is less than 0.3 suggesting that though it is significant the the strength of uh, as, uh, the, the strength of uh, significance is not that high however since it's uh, the value is significant we can report that there is significant difference between the type of store and the level of satisfaction. 